Clarity, consistency, communication. An effective flowchart clearly communicates the sequence of actions, movements, and decisions within a system to provide a detailed overview of a process. The way to do that consistently and create broad understanding is by using industry standard symbols and connectors, or the language of a flowchart. Let's dive into the symbols guide and get to know the building blocks of visualization. For starters, no matter who builds the flowchart, everyone works from the same set of basic shapes you see here. The most common shapes, the ones you'll find in each flowchart, are as follows. The start, end, or the terminator symbol identifies the start or end points of a process. A process symbol represents an entire action or operation as a single step or sub-process. Decision points are marked with a diamond and show where questions must be answered before proceeding. This arrow indicates the direction of the process flow. To create deeper meaning or chart a more specific scenario, there are more advanced symbols. A connector represents the continuation of flow through multiple charts or pages. Input, output, or the data symbol represents received or generated information or material. The note provides space for explanation and comments. An actor symbol shows someone or something interacting with the process or workflow. The document symbol signifies the input or output of a document or report. This one is for more than one. A preparation symbol differentiates between the setup and the work itself, or introduces setup of another process step. Delay indicates a waiting period where multiple things must happen before the process proceeds. Display represents a step where information will be shown to the user. Manual input is where a user enters information manually, and a manual operation symbol relays that part of the process needs to be performed manually. Off-page connector, or the link symbol, shows the continuation of a process across multiple pages. A database symbol represents info stored in a location that allows for search, filtering, and sorting. Internal storage is for visualizing data saved within internal memory. The X-shaped summing junction is the point at which multiple branches converge into a single process while the cross, or or symbol, is the spot where the process diverges into more than one branch. The stored data symbol highlights where data will be stored within the process. A predefined process is a placeholder for a complex process that's defined elsewhere. This triangle represents the extraction or removal of specific sets of items. On the flip side, an upside down triangle is the merging of multiple processes into one. The bisected diamond symbolizes a step where data, information, or materials are sorted and organized. The collate symbol represents a step in the process that requires organizing data into a standard format. Magnetic tape, or sequential access storage, indicates information stored in a sequence on magnetic tape. Swim lanes are containers holding process steps within horizontal or vertical lanes. The outdated paper tape symbol is used for mapping processes or input methods on older computers and machines. As for the connecting lines, they have some specific meanings as well. This one simply shows a process flowing from one shape to another. The dashed line denotes alternate paths or an alternate process. Parallel lines represent a synchronization process where steps above must happen before those below can occur. There you have it, your complete flowchart symbol and connector guide. The only thing left to do now is to start diagramming with SlickPlan.